The challenge layer is all about the minimum viable version of the platform to put in front of the envisioned participants. What are the key building blocks for the platform to be able to take off? And which building blocks can be put on hold for the next iteration of platform design? In this step, you select the most essential building blocks from both the transaction engine and the innovation engine to assemble the minimum viable platform experience. The transaction engine delivers the key touch points in which the participants meet in order to exchange value. The innovation engine provides the key services that support the participants in exchanging that value. By combining these building blocks and selecting the most essential ones, the first incarnation of the platform experience for the Envision ecosystem can be assembled. Now, assemble your platform experience. If someone asks you, what's your platform? A platform experience is your answer. The platform experience is what you want to bring to the ecosystem. Focus on the minimal amount of the intervention into the ecosystem. Take your platform experience map and start by plotting the most essential touch points that need to be in place in order for the participants to be able to engage and exchange value. Leave out the for now non-essential touch points. For instance, here we decided to leave out the touch point arrange that can be done using a channel outside of the platform. Select the services you are confident about are the most important ones to get the roles going and engaging repeatedly. You can determine which services are the most essential ones by building out from the first touch point a role initiates. For instance, before a guest can reserve a unique home, the unique home needs to be found. This search can be supported by city guides. And before a guest can even start looking for a unique home, he or she will need to have a valid profile on Airbnb. And in order for the host to be able to confirm a request, the unique home needs to be published. And before the unique home gets published, the host will schedule for a photographer. But in order to be able to do that, the host needs to onboard first. And only with a valid profile, a payout can be made. Use three different colors for the touch points, the platform service is provided to the role number one and the platform service is provided to the role number two. It's only once you know what the platform experience is that you can use the business model canvas to detail out what you will need to build your platform organization. The key activities of Airbnb can be summarized as matchmaking and curated inventory for the participants. Coordinating photographers and integrating payments represent platform activities that need to be taken care of too. Key resources are the platform services and profiles for both guests and hosts to be able to engage with each other. A 
payment processor and local photographers constitute the key partners in this version of the platform experience. What are Airbnb's customer segments? Well, guests and hosts consume services provided by Airbnb. Airbnb's landing page screams out the value propositions for both customer segments, experience like a local and earn money safely. What relationship does each customer segment expect Airbnb to establish and maintain? It's a personal one for both the guest and the host. How do Airbnb's value propositions reach its customer segments? That one was detailed out in the transaction engine using app and web. And last but not least, the cost structure and revenue streams. Airbnb needs to take care of the overall IT infrastructure, as well as the payment processor and the photographers. In exchange for that, it takes up to 13% per guest booking and between 3 to 5% per booking from the host side as part of its revenue streams. And now you have everything you need to start organizing for the learning from the future versions of your ecosystem.